So extension classes are an, like an extra math period or a math lab that we have throughout the day. Um, in extension class, usually on Monday, is when we look back at our um, goal setting folder and I'll meet with kids one-on-one uh, -on -one to discuss how they're doing. We'll pull up their dream box. They'll ask me any questions that they have about it. I'll ask them some questions. Why, why haven't you been working more on it? Were you stuck? Do we need to look over something? Um, it's also um, like a intervention time too. So a lot of times Maybe I don't get to stuff during math. I can't pull everybody over one at a time during math class to work with. So I can do more small group in math class or they can continue their playlist. If they want to work more on whatever we're doing in math class, then they can bring it into extensions and work to finish up their playlist before Friday. So they really have more freedom during the extension time, but it also gives me more time to look at their goals and discuss with them. I have an extensions class eighth period. Uh, my extension class is a little different than uh, the sixth grade. Only students that have been flagged uh, by failing a STAR test, a state standardized test, are in my extensions, whereas uh, sixth grade has everybody. So I don't really use it as a second math class because mine are not only math, but they're reading. And so I have all the kids, I have 18 kids in my extensions class and every one of them has either failed the math or reading or both tests. And so they work on math and reading throughout the week. It's very student driven. The students come in and they'll say, okay, we, we need to work on reading today and they'll get their reading stuff out and work on what they need to there. And then if I have students that don't have reading, they'll say, okay, I wanna do a calculator um, assignment. And so they'll come up to the board and we'll throw the calculator, TI calculator up and they'll work through an activity on the board. And it's all student led and it's student chosen.